take over the world. Maybe try to get a seventh year. We'll try that first. Then they actually deny it this time. But, uh, you know, hire an agent um, and then try to, you know, go the basketball route, kind of see how that goes. Obviously, I have my NBA degree that I have to also finish. Um, just kind of go from there. Thanks. How do you, I mean, how do you kind of sum up the year for you and what this has meant to, to get back to this level and, and to get to the tournament? Um, I think it's been a lot of ups and downs and frustrating. You know, I had a different picture of how my role would be on this team. Um, and, you know, as far as like playing time wise and all and things in that nature. But obviously that ended up not being the case, but I ended up playing a, le a very big leadership role for these guys. And, you know, trying to give as much advice as I can, help out as much as I can, trying to be, you know, that that middleman between coaches and players and trying to, you know, things that weren't understood, trying to interpret those and try to explain it. And, you, you were here when they were at a high, you came back, you kind of, on the team that turned it back around, what's what's ahead for this program? Um, I mean, they're they're going to be in very good hands with Coach Mack, the guys that they have coming in, um, and the group of guys who are coming back now that have experience in the tournament, um, and they have a very talented class coming in. I think, you know, they're going to they're going to have a very very good year, and hopefully they'll definitely get back to the tournament. And, you know, I hope they make a deeper run.